Hey, welcome back everyone. This is FIFA 17. And guess what? I finally got my PC. Finally got my power supply, EVGA power supply. I hooked it up to my PC. So we're going to do some FIFA 17 uh, native uh, 4K gameplay. I'm running a GTX 970. I have 18 gigs of RAM. Uh, and I'm using AMD. Uh, I believe it's... Uh, AMD A8 which is 2.9 gigahertz it gets the job done uh, I can only run native 4k with like low settings I cannot do like medium I would have to put my Titan X inside to get the medium settings in in true native 4k so anyway without further ado let's go ahead and let's play the game and uh, let's do this I'm running a Windows 8 uh, Pro the reason I'm running a Windows 8 is because my uh, hard drive a few months ago got destroyed I had to replace my hard drive put the new SSD and uh, I lost my Windows 10 privileges which means I have to buy Windows 10 but I'm not looking to buy Windows 10 anytime soon quite honestly I'm not even a huge fan of Windows 10 just just to be frank with you all right let's play <clears throat> so you know Let's do game settings here. Let's uh, adjust this. Okay, there it is. I don't know if you guys can see it. Uh, I think I might have to show you like this. Hold on. Here, just to show you, uh, 3840, 2160. Uh, I'm putting all the rendering uh, settings to automatic because, you know, I'm running this in true native 4K. I cannot go medium because <clears throat> I don't think 970 can handle I would have to put Titan X and then uh, I'll be able to do medium settings. But there it is, guys. There's a resolution right there. It's a true native 4K in 16 by 9. So uh, let's go ahead and do this. All right, so let's go ahead and click OK. And then we can go play. All right, so here it is, FIFA 17 in uh, true native 4K. There it is, 2160p. Running on a PC. Here, clearly, you can see my mouse, me moving my mouse right there. So, currently, the game is loading. <clears throat> I'm using my old. Uh, Xbox 360 controller, so it gets the job done. Even though I'm running a 970, I'm gonna try and see if I can uh, do a uh, if I can do a medium settings I don't have my sound on because I'm I have to switch back to my uh, Asia my audio uh, output and I don't want to go through that right now you guys don't want to hear the sound you just want to see the picture and the, the resolution that's all you guys care about you know because I'm using my sound blaster and I you know you cannot output sound blaster uh, right now via my TV because it doesn't support that pass-through so what I have to do I have to switch back to my HDMI sound out uh, which I don't want to go through that right now I just want to show you how the game looks on true native 4k nobody cares about the sound anyway <clears throat> alright so let's do this I'll just do a, a quick uh, kickoff really really fast. That's all I care about right now. I don't want to go through the journey. I just want to show you how the game looks in uh, native 4K resolution. We'll go with, uh, hold on. Bayern versus uh, Chelsea, how about that?
and clearly you can see a little bit of lag because you know I'm running a GTX 970 as soon as I put my Titan X on there which I'm gonna install as soon as I put my Titan X you will see a much much bigger difference Titan X should be able to handle this a little bit better. All right. Let's press start and let's do this. So there it is. Obviously, I don't have the sound on because I haven't turned my HDMI out audio. Well, obviously there you see uh, you see a little bit of you see a bunch of lag because you know my 970 can barely handle this you know all the detail and uh, but it looks great it looks great once this is a true native 4k guys and uh, once I get my Titan X you guys will see a much 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 better difference and I do have Titan X which I'm gonna show it to you guys when I install it I want you guys to see it you know because uh, I'm doing this for you, to my subscribers. I'm not doing this for, you know, the clowns. I don't care what they think. I know what I have. I, I know, you know, who I am. So I don't, I'm not proving this to them. I'm, I'm doing this for you guys because you guys are my subscribers. That's all I care about is you. you. I do this for you, for my subscribers. I don't do this for clowns. I'll never prove anything to clowns because they're not worth my time. Okay, let's do a little bit of uh, gameplay. So it looks fantastic. I mean, in a, in a native 4K, this looks fantastic. Let's switch the cameras. You know, once I get my uh, GTX Titan X inside, it's going to look much, much better. But let's switch the cameras. Let's go and go through cameras. Let's go to settings. Uh, let me see over here. Game settings and uh, I like to keep my camera at broadcast I, I love broadcast it's much better alright so let's do that and let's continue so there it is I mean you know true native 4k I think I don't know I think Project Scorpio obviously will be able to do this because Project Scorpio has six teraflops, uh, and uh, I think Titan X it's eight teraflops. But the one thing that Titan X also has is the very fast memory bus, and I think uh, 3,000 CUDA cores helps Titan. Look, Titan X is the beast. So once I put my Titan X inside the PC, you guys will truly see a difference you know in the frame rates and everything you know so this is just my first attempt just to show you that uh, how t you know that 970 it's not bad it's a good entry level but it barely can handle uh, 4k I mean it like barely it can handle it but as you can see it barely handles it uh, I would have to get uh, tight necks in there which I will put tight necks uh, shortly later and uh, We'll try this game again with Titan X and you'll see much, much bigger difference, much more improvement once I put 12 gigabytes of GDDR5, 3000 CUDA cores, and uh, 8 teraflops, I think. 8 teraflops the, the freaking thing has. So. But hey, this is good for what it's worth, you know? Which means you can still use 970. You might have to be beefed up your memory a little bit but I, I honestly I, I recommend if you truly want to run your 4k native resolution on your PC go with a Titan X and I'm gonna show you my Titan X uh, and if people ask me how did I get Titan X actually I got it through a this company that that leases the graphics card I was leasing it and I paid it off in like within a year I think uh, gamers edge or something like that or gaming edge I forgot edge gaming I think Review Tech USA uh, recommended it to me, and I got it. So, thank you, Rich. Um, come on, do a goal. Do it. Ah! All right, guys. I'll see you on my next video. I'll do a Titan X. I'll I'll install my Titan X. I'll see you in the next video, guys. Have a good one. Take care.